Iguodala to Curry, back to Iguodala, up to the left, oh, blocked by James! LeBron James with the rejection! To Curry, three down to Bang! Bang! Oh, what a step from Curry! Durant handling, Durant down the lane! What is going on guys, Eros here and I'm back with another video. Today's gonna be a short and sweet video, but it's a really good one. Guys, we've got some really great news. Uh, I saw on Bleacher Report today on uh, Twitter that it has officially been confirmed that three on three basketball will be an official Olympics uh, event coming now in 2020. It will start. I wanted to read you guys some of the official rules that have been released by FIBA. And um, it says here, it's gonna be a half court game that features a 12 second shot clock. The game ends after a single 10 minute period or when one team reaches 21 points. So it's a 21 point, I guess, mercy and then it's over. Uh, every shot made inside the three point arc is worth one point and shots beyond the arc are worth two. So it's 1.2 point. Uh, after a change of possession on a missed shot or a turnover, the ball must be taken back beyond the three-point arc. The same rule applies after a made basket, which makes sense. That's like your typical street ball game where you play half court. You got to take it back, you know, otherwise you can get some cheap baskets. So that makes it very fair. And a team consists of four players, three starters, and a substitute. And there are no coaches, so they coach themselves. So if I were to put together, this is going to be interesting, if I were to put together my own, you know, if I could choose the three or four players that I want on this team, I'm going to have to go with definitely LeBron because he's going to be sort of your floor general. He's going to be directing everything, making the right passes, throwing down alley-oops, you know, driving the lane, kicking it out. I would then choose a guy like Steph Curry. This is really tough, guys. I mean, you really can't go wrong. You could throw... Three, you know, you could put out Harrison Barnes, Clay Thompson, and uh, I don't know Draymond Green, and I'd give them a good shot to win the whole thing in the world. So I, I think a three-on-three -three tournament. I don't think really anyone in the world stands a chance against what the U.S. can throw at them. Uh, you know, if you thought five-on-five five was easy for the U.S., I feel like three-on-three is just going to be even easier. It's going to be like, you know, just NBA guys going to like a street ball park in the middle of New York City, and just you know these street ball guys think they're all good, but then playing against LeBron and Durant and Curry it's just uh, it would just be so unfair but it's gonna be super entertaining to watch I know you guys have probably heard about uh, Ice Cube's three on three big three tournament this summer that's gonna be interesting to watch that's probably gonna give us somewhat of an idea of what this could be like in the um, in the Olympics uh, however um, yeah let, let's see here uh, as far as three players I would pick you know, like I said I'm definitely going with LeBron I would say I would definitely go with Curry just for, because of the shooting ability. And a third player, it's tough. I would say, yeah, definitely LeBron and Curry. But the third player, it really could be exchanged with a lot of guys. I mean, I would say probably Durant, uh, maybe Kawhi Leonard. I mean, you really can't go wrong. I don't think you really want big guys, you know, in this. Uh, you want guys that are, you know, free-flowing, can shoot, can drive, can do everything. Uh... But yeah, I'm going to go with LeBron, Curry, and Durant. That's going to be my three. And then if I were to pick a substitute, a uh, substitute would probably have to be Kawhi Leonard just because of the defense. And the three and three, you do need to play good defense because the floor is definitely more open. Even though it is you know, only a half-court game, it's a much more open floor. So between LeBron and uh, Kawhi Leonard, I think those two just would shut down any three on three game if they're both on the floor at the same time. So yeah, guys, that's it. Uh, let me know if you guys think this is exciting. I don't see how you don't think it's exciting. I, I think there's, I mean, they're still gonna keep the five on five game, I'm pretty sure. They didn't say they're taking that away, but they did definitely confirm that they're adding this new three on three uh, basketball aspect that will start, like I said, in the 2020 Olympics. Um, yeah, so this is very exciting, guys. Uh, I'll catch you on the next one. Be sure to subscribe, like, comment, and share this video with everyone. Let everybody know, and I will see you on the next one. I just like this.